hello guys welcome to today's video by ts tech talk today guys i'm going to be showing you more tips on the facebook messenger room today i'm going to be showing you guys how to lock your room from people f um to stop people from entering probably if you want to kick out some people or you really want um you reach the limit of your particular meeting or conference video and you don't want any more distraction or anybody coming in as a late comma depending on whatever you want so this is just how to kick somebody out and leave the room locked go ahead and open your facebook messenger go over to the um people click on create room and share the link i'm going to invite some people from messenger and send send so um let's wait for some minutes till they till they join the room So um, while we are waiting, you guys noticed on the previous video, guys, I showed you guys how to wow. kick somebody out, but I didn't actually show you guys how to block the room from people to en for, to stop people from entering. So if I actually kick somebody out and I decide to stop them from entering, you can see what happens. So um, bro, try to enter back immediately. I uh, block you. So let me go ahead and kick somebody out and then allow him to try to enter back again. So um, I'm just going to go to see members and then remove somebody, then remove. So um, usually um, this automatically locks the room. You can notice where it says prevent people from um, joining the room. You can notice it's turned on lock. So if you click on this icon now, you can notice it's enable to join back you can notice the person joined back in that's because it's enabled to join back but if i if i turn on this lock button it's going to prevent people from joining the room back so i can go ahead and remove the guy and then ask him to join back in so bro try to join back again then Another funny thing is if you lock the group and the person is trying to join back, this is where you will notice that the person is trying to join back because it doesn't always um, indicate here, but it usually shows on your chat message that the person is trying to join. So um, let me click on it. Okay, um, he's probably not trying to join because if you notice if he was trying to join, you are going to get a message like um, he's trying to join your video. But this last, okay, you can notice um, Clubberland Kindness tried to join the video because he just tried to join it now. So if he actually tried to join the video and he wasn't able to join, you can go ahead and turn on the room. Go to the lock option, turn it on, and then go right back to your messenger. And then call the person back again. So um, the person is actually going to see that and... He will be able to join. Okay, it's currently locked. Let me go ahead and unlock. I think now he will be able to join if he tries to join again. So in case he didn't remember to join, I can still go and remind him by calling him. So welcome back, bro. So this actually works well. This is how to lock the group and unlock the group. For um some reason, if you don't want people to join your conversation or your video conference room. So thank you guys for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Make sure you subscribe and share the video with your friends. See you guys soon. Stay home and stay safe. Peace.